Python for Everybody specializations from the University of Michigan. It's in the top 3 most popular Python courses on Coursera and probably on the Internet. Currently, it has over 1.5 million students, over 200,000 reviews and the high rating of 4.8 stars out of 5. But is it really worth your money, when there are plenty of other good courses that cost less? My name is Daniel and today we are going to look at Python for Everybody specialization on Coursera. In this video we will discuss course overview, course content, pricing and certification. Traditionally we will have a look at student reviews and I will provide my own opinion on this specialization. Alright guys, let's start. Course overview. According to the Stack Overflow developer survey, Python is one of the most popular programming languages today. And we all know why. But for us, developers, that means promising career opportunities and attractive salary packages. That's why there is no surprise so many people want to make a career as Python developers. But here is the thing. To start this journey, you need the best course or guide. And Python for Everybody specialization designed by the University of Michigan is one of the best out there. So what is it about? First of all, it needs to be said that it's a course for complete newbies. And I mean, it's not one of those learning programs that claim they are ok for beginners. But really require some basic knowledge. No, guys, Python for everybody is designed to teach you all the basics from scratch. That's why in this case all you need is really a computer and the desire to learn. First you will install Python on your device, then you will get familiar with all the fundamental Python commands, next you will learn how to use variables to store, retrieve and calculate information. You will understand how to deal with exceptions, you will get comfortable with basic programming tools like loops and functions, and finally you will practice organizing these elements into basic clever programs and run them. So, as you see folks, you can enroll even if you know nothing about programming and be able to use Python in your projects after you complete the course. And I mean basic level of Python and simple projects. On the other hand, if you are already familiar with Python and want to take your skills to the next level, Python for everybody might not be the right choice for you. And in this case you will need to choose a more advanced course. Course Instructor. People, if you have seen other course reviews on this channel, you know that many of them are instructed by large teams of professionals. This is not the case. There is only one instructor for Python for everybody. I know some of you can see it as a drawback. But consider that it's just an introductory specialization, not a comprehensive professional certification program. Besides, you can change your mind after I tell you a little about Charles Russell Severance, the course instructor, also known as Dr. Chuck. He is a professor at the University of Michigan School of Information. Dr. Chuck is the go-to guy for tech-related courses, covering everything from programming to database design and web development. He is also the author of several books, such as Using Google App Engine and Python for Everybody. By the way, the latter is the book this course is based on. And you might want to get it because it will make your learning easier. That's why I will add the link to this book in the description. Saying about the course, it isn't big by any standards, guys. You will be able to get through it in a couple of months if you spend just 10 hours per week learning. And I think it's a fair amount of time for an introduction course. Content. Guys, before we move on, I try to make educational content in an entertaining way, make it fun instead of boring. And in return, I just ask to like this video and subscribe to my channel, if you enjoy the content I make. That's all. The Python for Everybody specialization is a core series made up of 5 separate courses. By the way, you can take them separately and in any order you like. But I would recommend taking the entire specialization from start to finish. Especially if you are a newbie who knows nothing or very little about Python. And here are the 5 courses included here. Programming for everybody getting started with Python, Python data structures, using Python to access web data, using databases with Python, and capstone retrieving processing and visualizing data with Python. You know guys, after doing some research on this course content, I can say it's very well structured. At the end of the program there is a big capstone project, 
to reinforce all you have learned in practice. Moreover, every course comes with multiple quizzes. However, folks, I can say that this is a very hands-on experience. Again, it's not necessarily a bad thing, because it's just an introductory course series. You are not supposed to work on complex tasks at every step of the way. It's really pretty simple and straightforward. What I really like is that the course takes you through Python basics gradually, step by step. Because there are lots of courses that throw some advanced stuff at you right after the first couple of steps. And it's nice to see it's not the case here. Pricing and certification Alright, so what can I say about the price for this specialization? Well, as you already know, it's on Coursera. So, it's not a free course. You will have to get a monthly subscription to complete it. The good news is that it's part of Coursera Plus. And that means that when you get the subscription, you will also get unlimited access to thousands of other courses at no extra cost. Coursera pricing might change, so I recommend that you go and check it out on the platform. I left the link in the description. As for certification, you will get a Coursera certificate of completion for each course you finish. And when you complete the entire specialization, you will also get a career certificate from the University of Michigan. And it can be a nice addition to your LinkedIn profile or your resume. However, guys, I think in this case the knowledge you get is much more valuable than this certificate. Student reviews Ok, let's see what students who took this course think about it. As I said at the beginning of this video, this specialization program is very well reviewed. And the majority of these reviews are very positive. It looks like people are happy with the amount of content and love the teaching style. There is, for example, this 5-star review. I have been with Charles Russell Severance since the very first course, from my first sprint Hello World, all the way to creating databases, parsing the web, and creating visualizations with data, computers and technology is my passion. This will always be one of the courses I will remember for the rest of my life. Because it gave me a good foundation, I have tried to learn Python on many other occasions, but I never seemed to have followed through. I just clicked with Charles. He is funny, passionate and an amazing teacher. But guys, I also found some criticism. People note, for example, that practical assignments were not challenging enough. I think this is a great beginner's course on how to code and the foundation concepts you will need to know to do work as data analyst Python user. That being said, while the lectures and sample code are great, I feel that the assignments were too easy, not challenging enough to really ingrain the material. So, guys, I already mentioned this earlier. There is not much here in terms of practical content. But I will say it one more time. It's just a basic introductory course, not a portfolio builder. And if you're looking something more heads-on, you should look at other courses. Guys, I reviewed many Python courses on my channel. So, feel free to check them out. Is Python for everybody worth it? And finally, here is the last question for today. Should you invest your time and money in this course series? Well, folks, I want to say that if you are a complete beginner who wants to learn Python from scratch, this specialization program will be great for you. It will gradually take you from A to Z and give you all the basics you need. And in my opinion, it is one of the best introduction Python courses ever made. So my answer is absolutely yes. But if you're an experienced Python developer who is looking for some more advanced knowledge, you should definitely pick a different course. Alright, my fellow developers, this is all about Python for Everybody specialization on Coursera. I left useful links in the description below, make sure to check them out. As always, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel, if you want to see more reviews like this. And finally, thanks for watching, until next time.